So, it's been a while. Um, it's a nice rainy day today. I know most people maybe don't like that, but for me, I love it. I, I think it brings like this new energy out of me. And I thought, you know, it's a great day for an update, I think. Um, I haven't been active for a while now, especially not on YouTube, but also on Twitter and Discord. Like I used to post, you know, at least a few times a week, um, but not for the past month. And there's a couple of reasons for it. And I want to talk about it just in, in a short uh, session. One thing is that I've been talking about potentially working on a new project, which is something that I've been anticipating. I've been waiting on their answer. What are they going to answer? What are they going to answer? And just, I don't know. It just, I didn't find the right energy to work on my thing. And also I've been working on the proposal, like the idea for a project, which is something that I never did. Like usually I'm working on a game. I get an idea for the next game, you know, a classic game development thing. Um, but then, yeah, I have, you know, a lot of time to think about it because I'm still working on a previous project. Uh, this is the exact thing that happened with this new game I'm making. I got the idea for it a couple of years ago and, you know, I just had time to think about it and it's well thought out and I'm super excited on working on it. Um, but yeah, for this game, I just needed to think about it. Just, you know, from the ground up, just think about the whole thing and, and you know, think it through. So this was a new experience, but it was definitely fun. Like, I think... I think I got a really good idea, so we'll see. Maybe that's something that I'm gonna do, but it's not certain, like this is just one possibility. Uh, the other thing that uh, was keeping me busy is I'm making a new implementation, like a new integration for Necrobouncer. It's a really cool one, like I'm super excited about uh, working on it. There's this company that found uh, my game uh, through my publisher, I think and they want to try this thing out uh, in, in Necrobouncer as well. So I'm really excited to try it out and we'll see. Hopefully we can uh, show it off in a couple of months. I don't know how much I can tell you right now, so I'm just gonna, you know, keep silent and then update you when something new happens. Um, so that's basically it. That's the main reason I was a bit unactive for the past uh, month because, I don't know, I was just, you know, anxious. I was a bit nervous what's gonna happen. And of course, I was working on the new integration, not for a long time now, but it's just, we were talking about it. We had some meetings and I don't know, it just, I was just nervous about it. And it kept me from, you know, working on my game. I was just a bit stressed, I guess. Uh, stressed is not the right word, really. It's more of, I was just anxious. And, you know, creative work, I think that kind of suffers in that department if you're like anxious. So I think that's what happened. But anyway, um, I have been working on a new game though. I haven't showed it yet on the YouTube channel, but I did talk about it a lot on Twitter and Discord. So if you want to be more, you know, updated uh, as the thing is developing, I would definitely invite you to follow me on Twitter or join my Discord server. Both of them will be linked down below. But um, yeah, um, I have been working on it for a couple of months now and there's a lot to show. So today I would just like to show it off real quick. Uh, I'm not gonna go too much in depth, like what's it about, what's the story. There's a lot of the things that I could talk about, but I don't wanna go too much in depth. I'm just gonna give you a quick tour, you could say, and you know, show off a bit of how it looked at the beginning, how it looks now, what's it about, so. So the game is about a programmer fighting an alien invasion of bugs. How that happens is Basically, you get recruited by an out-of-touch general, army general, because as you self-advertised, you are the best at eliminating bugs. So that's the short story, but there's gonna be more. I hope to develop the story for this game way more than I did for Necrobouncer. And I also have a friend of mine that's really good at writing. Uh, help me write this story. Uh, he's already working on like a backstory and stuff like that. So I'm super excited about that. Um, but yeah, basically, the game is really similar to Necrobouncer. It's still an action roguelike, I think that's what it's called. And you, you know, you, you go room by room, you explore randomly generated dungeons, stuff like that, you fight enemies. But the main thing that I'm trying to explore with this game is the, I like to call it a gum building or, or uh, magazine building. And what that means is, imagine uh, playing a deck builder but instead of building a deck of cards, you're building a magazine of bullets. So you have uh, a so-called fabricator, which you find when you defeat a, like a really big bug, that's mostly that, but we're, we're gonna get to that later. But basically, 
you get this fabricator which creates stuff and you figure out that it can create magazines for your gun because you know that's something you need all the time and yeah this basically just fabricates them just infinite amount it can never be depleted but in addition to this it has some slots on top and you can equip different modules and bullets in those slots and basically when you shoot the gun every let's say you equip the bullet in the third slot every third bullet in each magazine is gonna be that special bullet and then you can have bullets that combine with each other you can have bullets that modify the bullet after them uh, there's like a bunch of combinations you can do You'll, you're gonna have modules that are like bigger sized not bullets but they're like modules and they they give some sort of an effect and you can then equip bullets on top of it and basically you'll combine this with items and maybe some other stuff uh, definitely some abilities but all of these things are gonna be module all of these things are gonna be limited this is most important so you're gonna have a limited amount of space in your magazine you're gonna have a limited amount of space for items which is something that I learned from Necrobouncer which wasn't limited in how many items you could have and basically this means that eventually you would get so strong that like the game didn't didn't really challenge the player anymore so this is something that I would like to do differently so have a limited amount of items so that you have to really think about your build and also when equipping bullets you can not switch their positions you have to equip them in one slot and then you can only replace them with something else which makes you discard the previous bullet so I'm not you know, nothing is 100% yet, of course, there's a lot of testing to be done, but this is the general idea for now. So I'm gonna leave it at that. You saw a bit of the footage, uh, it's still, you know, early, um, and I can't say anything for sure how it's gonna be, but I just wanted to show it off, you know, in a short video, so this is what I'm doing, and I hope to do this more often. My setup for making videos is now much simpler. I decided to forego all the production there wasn't much production but like I had lights I had to set up a camera I had the blinds down there were there was a lot of work and I just don't want to do that anymore I want to focus on the content and focus on me working on the game it took just way too much time and it was one of the main reasons I, it took me so long to make another video it's just it was too much work so I'm gonna try to keep it a bit simpler and you know just focus on content and development so hopefully you enjoyed this uh, if you have any comments on the game if you're like interested in something like please comment down below I would love to talk about it you can also join my discord server we talk about it there and maybe you know follow me on Twitter if you want uh, definitely uh, like the video if you liked it that would you know help me out a lot uh, subscribe if you want to know more I'm gonna try to do this more often now and yeah, uh, hopefully I see you when I do this uh, the next time. So <laughs> uh, yeah, uh, thanks for watching and have a good one. Bye.